Hello my Aries friends and welcome to your special singles Valentine's reading. So this reading is for anyone who is single and or on the dating scene. So let's get started and see who your future true love and or soulmate is that's coming in for you Aries. So the first card I pull is going to represent your energy um, with regards to love relationships and how you're attracting someone into your life, Aries. And the second card I pull is going to represent your soulmate's energy and how you can recognize them. Okay, so you have the Six of Swords and they have the Five of Cups. Aww. Okay, so Aries. So with the five of sword or six of swords here energy representing you, um, so you may have experienced perhaps some difficulties in love in the past, or just things just haven't worked out the way you've wanted to. You or you may have just been struggling um, finding someone. Sometimes it can be hard, um, especially if you're not um, in it. Your, your, your life situation isn't one where, for example, you're in college or university and it's much easier to, um, you're surrounded by a bunch of people your own age and, and in your age range and so it's sometimes easier to, to find love that way when you're in that kind of a situation. So you may have struggled with that or you could have experienced something in the past where you know love was a little disappointing or let you down or or it just didn't work out for whatever reason. But now with that Six of Swords energy you are ready to transition and you're ready to um, move from those choppy waters into the calm waters. So I also feel like perhaps that you're looking for, for a type of um, relationship or um, love interest to come in that has a more stable energy and and an even type of emotional energy so now the person um, your your soulmate or your true love has the energy of the five of cups so this, the person coming in do do be aware that this person in the, has been experiencing um, loss feeling abandoned feeling unloved so they've really had a doozy of a time with past relationships. So do know that that's the energy that's around them as they come in. So do make sure, Aries, that, that as you meet this person and get to know this person, be, just be gentle, take your time, um, because that's the energy that, that's around them. So I'm going to pull a chemistry tile to see what kind of energy or chemistry the two of you will have when you meet. Okay, so you will have the chemistry of cups energy. Very nice. So with this person, Aries, you're going to have a deep emotional connection with this person. So this person is going to be your muse, your inspiration. They're going to be the most beloved person in your life. You're going, you're going to fall hard and fast for this person. That's, that's how it's, and they will for you as well when you meet. And you'll have a very deep, deep emotional bond and emotional connection with this person. So I'm now going to check for eye color and hair color. So I'm going to roll the dice for um, eye color first. And we have brown. So Aries, the person coming in for you has brown eyes. And let's check the hair. So they are either have bald, or they could even shave their head bald. Um, they have gray hair or dyed hair. So... Their hair color may not be their natural hair color when you meet them. <laughs> they could be dyeing a different color. And now I'm going to pull a zodiac trinket here and to see what their sun, moon, rising, or Venus sign is going to be. And it's going to be a Capricorn. So they're going to either be a Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign Capricorn energy. And I'm now going to pull an alphabet tile. And let's see what their first name or their last name, first letter is. And we have a Y. So their first name or their last name is going to start with a Y. 
Okay, Aries, and I'm going to now pull two um, Romance Angel Oracle cards for any final bits of information on the energy of the relationship and the chemistry that is around the two of you and surrounding the two of you. So we have Honeymoon. Okay, and express your love. So Aries, with the honeymoon card, this means that you could be going, when you do meet this person, not long after you meet this person, you may find that you're going on a holiday together. So enjoy the bliss of the holiday time together. And then also express your love. So Aries, do know to go ahead and make ro the romantic gesture. If you find that you, 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 you meet someone and you feel that emotional connection right away to someone, um, make that romantic gesture with them. So Aries, this concludes your special Valentine's reading. I hope you enjoyed it and take care.